Hey guys. Come on guys. Happy Super Bowl. I gotta put my bet in too. Hey, hey guys. Oh my gosh, we got two in here, holla. You guys know this one, wait for like a little bit of people. Hey, and then I'ma start Grand Rising King. All right, so guys, I'ma do a love reading this morning cause I just woke up with so like love and feelings. You know, yesterday I was super sexy, divine empress. That's every day, but today I feel a little bit of love. You know, so I feel like somebody needs a love reading. And I got some karma cards just in case because I feel like I'm, we might got to talk some shit to a karmic energy that's that's surrounding our love lives. Tell it go away. Abundance, love, abundance. Demonstrate love. Hey, demonstrate love. That's what I'm here for today. Guys, I have like 90,000 decks, okay? And you guys, listen, I'll do free readings for you. Free readings. You know I work a lot, so I just got to like in between, but I could do one free one for you. Promise, change your whole life. Guidance, that's it guidance nothing bad nothing nothing bad guys good heart good intentions i started this shit with a uh, spirit like god god shit okay yeah god shit wait can i say god shit in, in the same uh, whatever i said it oh, whatever all right i got my r&b mix playing guys so i think we could start we have, oh, it's two people. We can start, guys. I'm sorry. It's 1128. I'm starting, okay? Too bad I can't see my regular time clock. Sometimes time clock's good. Oh, my job's inter... Why is my job sending me emails? They better go away. It's snowing and I'm not working today. Go away. All right, guys. You re Oh, I need one more person before... Hey, every... I don't know who's still here, but I just need one more person, guys, and we can start. Because this is, like, about a relationship. Not me. I'm not, I'm, I'm not spicy today. Ooh, this is about a relationship. Look at guys. That's like a pathway relationship. Ooh. That's for spiritual court. Up for spiritual court. All right. Someone's trying to send me a message. I can't. Oh, hey. I think you just tried to send me a message, boo. But um, I can check it in a second, okay? Thanks for being here. Okay, I'll put it up on my, after I actually will put it up on my thing. Yes, thank you for voting for me. Oh yeah, I keep forgetting. I love that I'm doing that. You guys don't forget to vote for me, Miss Ink Cover Magazine 2021. I made it third round around the world, baby. That's a lot. All right, let's go. So I'm, so right now I got, ooh, this is a message from Divine Empress. I almost said my other YouTube name, but that's okay. So this is a message for somebody about a certain pathway that they're not following. You guys follow your heart. Three plus five is eight. Abundance. Relationships usually are about abundance. I put the links up for you guys to, to see them. Listen, relationships are for when you guys come together to be able to manifest and create something. Okay, divine feminine. If you're not a divine feminine, don't be here. Surprise. Congratulations. This is for divine feminines. I got something for those karmics. Ooh, and divine masculine has a lot to say. Usually when divine masculine has a lot to say, the cards pop out like this. But you guys don't talk in 3D. Somebody's worried about something that they did. Relax. Ooh, you'll still get your wealth. You'll still get it. Look, at, and this is a twin flame number 11. So listen, twin flame soulmates relationships, they're for abundance and prosperity. They're not for fighting and all the other shit. No, no, no. This is what it's about. C11, one and one. I'm going to just point it to you guys. Look, at, and they're most of the time supported and guided by your higher ancestors. Hello, how do you think you guys met each other? One ancestor said, nah, we got shit to do. It's, yeah, it's a community. It's, it's, it's your ancestors, it's people behind you. It's people that are sitting there, people that passed over. Listen, look at people that passed over. I can't make this shit up. So listen, guys, your relationships are supported by people that passed over. You know, the aunt, cousin, grandma, friend, something. They are the ones that help you ask them. Yo, bro. Ooh, yo, bro, listen. There are false people around you. If you guys are hearing this reading or see this reading, just know that, ooh, hey, bro, might not be, hey, bro. Go by the way you feel. I don't know why spirit keeps having me do that. Anyone that gives you bad feelings, it's not for you. They're not for you. I'm supposed to be doing love readings. I'm getting over this karmic energy. But just because spirit wants me to tell you guys that, be careful the people around you. Go by your gut intuition. 
it's by the way you feel okay if they don't make you feel good if they're not supposed to be in your life period okay so change your surroundings anyone you're around that's not supposed to be there nine ending cycles so it may be a karmic person sit with yourself meditate you're like to me i was like hell no it cannot be the people that i think hell no you keep fighting that shit. It, it you can't fight it so listen god is the only one okay one the main male one me you and god right now okay hey boo i'm glad I, this is you're divinely guided this is what it's all about helping people loving each other okay yeah because look if you don't love yourself you're gonna be like this poverty three plus seven seven eight nine i'm not good with math 10 completion so once you get those bad people out of your life they give you the bad feelings and the bad everything anxiety whatever you're going to be able to you're going to be able to prosper all your hard work they're watching you don't let people watch you i don't know i'm supposed to be doing a love reading yet yeah, because somebody thinks you're way more mature than them and they look at i'm supposed to be doing a love reading but spirit said i got something else for you okay Somebody's watching you, everything that you do, okay? And they're watching you too with your shorty. So watch your shorty. You're supposed to be able to trust her. It's more about trusting her and less about them. Like a nigga's gonna be a nigga and a hoe's gonna be a hoe. Your car goes in her garage. So we already know who to blame. We already know who to blame. If that's the case, if it fits, it fits. If, if not, it's not. That's your bitch, your main lady, okay? Only you and her, okay? You guys add other people if you want, duh. But like at the end of the day, it's just supposed to be you and her. Your word with her word, that's it. Nobody else is, okay? Yeah, family, prosperous. This is what you really want, but you're just, you know, it takes some time to get there. Two plus one is three, yeah. Hey, three's for divinity, okay, guys? So, yeah, this relationship is all... Listen, your relationships are always supported and guided by the universe no matter what. I promise you. Hey, I promise you, okay? No doubt about it. But you have to maintain your expectations. You have to do what you have to do. You can't think you're going to be in a relationship and something's going to go right and you're just sitting around. No. Work. Everything's work. Everything's with work and love. Okay, guys? And um, get up off your ass and stop doing so much thinking about the person you want to be with and put into action. Listen, God gives you the woman or man of your dreams. Take it. One plus seven is eight. Abundance. I can't make this shit up. Abundance, guys. Okay? So your thoughts of whoever you want to be with is will create, generate abundance for you. Okay? I was listening to this all morning. No commercials. Now I do my reading. It's commercials. I'm glad it gets used to listen to me. So, yeah, this is from me to you. Hey, I'm from Spirit saying, listen, this is a message to let you know that this is where you need to be, okay? Thank you to my YouTube, to YouTube subscribers that came over. I see you guys. Hey, so excited. Yes, thank you. Um, I'm going to follow up with the YouTube video after this, okay? Thank you. Um, So, yeah, so this relationship that you want, you are divinely guided to take. Take your time. Nothing happens overnight. Four is for love. Four, love, domestic, family. Um, oh my God, there's so many things for four, but just know that when you see four, so today, you guys, if you see this reading four, 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 44, that's, that's because you were divinely guided, okay? And get out of this energy of being in despair. Spirit has everything. You're only in despair because you don't want to change. Change. If you change, listen, it's not always the other person's fault. Once you change, change your thinking and you'll change your experiences, okay? divinity three you guys back me up with this go back and read go back and listen to what i said before if you just came in this is the ultimate goal so spirit puts us together with people to be married look at this uh, that's the way you're supposed to go three plus six is nine you got it in the karmic cycles listen and my nose runs when i'm telling the truth i noticed that in the last video i been knew that but but this is real so i gotta get a tissue guys damn i don't want to get up one second oh yeah look at because you're supposed to be with each other lovers okay this is where it's supposed to be, guys. One plus five is six. Holla. Number six. You know it. I'm occupied. Occupied. Occupation. So put do the work, okay? Make sure you guys do the work, okay? And if you guys want to live together, move together, I would just, you know, like that shacking up shit, eh, it's kind of living in sin too, guys. That's why I'm kind of big on not having sex. Uh, I, it's just, you know, you get rewarded for, for not for living in sin because, you know, being official and everything, God wants it to be right. Two plus two is four again. Love, domestic, duality, family, okay? Google me, baby. I know what I'm talking about. And the journey. Tens for completion. Ten of cups, the family life. That's what you want, okay? But, like, you know, something's coming in between you. Don't worry about it. Take the journey, okay? Do the journey. Go. Ten completion. Go. Don't stop. You're imprisoning your own self when you you think too much don't think too much and get rid of this rat 11 11 this is a twin flame relationship 
get rid of this rat i'm telling you guys there's someone around you that's just like not good for you and we the kids listen yes yes listen one plus eight good morning right one plus eight listen if you're with someone that you have a kid with and you're trying to end the relationship and you're worried about the kids spirit telling me right now to tell you that you are straight your kids are straight one plus eight is nine you need to close that karmic cycle listen i have four kids fathers you know that okay i'm there's no shame in my game but we do what we have to do for the kids at times it's fights and battles whatever as like anything else but at the end of the day i know that the main reason that we're supposed to be in each other's life is for those kids just because you have kids with someone doesn't mean you have to be with someone. I hate to tell you this, but you can't get a family from a fuck. Sorry, Spirit. I had to say that, okay? So listen, the person that you want to be with, 2 plus 7 is 9. You got it. You have to end those karmic cycles. There's no way you're going to get it if you don't, okay? Spirit's telling me right now to let you know this is confirmation. You let go of those karmic cycles that babe mother, ooh, my nose is running, and you will get everything that you need to. I don't even like to say babe mother, babe father. I have to get a touch, you guys. Hold on. All right, because yes, my nose runs every time when I do my tarot because it's real. This is like, that's how I knew it was two to two. I'm like, what the hell? Why is my damn nose running? Okay, so if you're worried or concerned about a relationship, me, you, and God, 33 is six. Also, eh, I love the number six. Um, Then you guys know that that's what time it is, okay? And you know, it was whoever does you wrong, they're going to have to go face spirit anyway. So don't worry about it. You're going to have face spirit for stealing someone's heart. You can't do that and get away with it. Two plus three is five. Two plus four is six. In divine timing, it's alignment. It happens to be like that. Five goes to six, okay, guys? So look at this. You're They're putting up for a spiritual court because they stole your time your money and your love okay so don't worry never worry about that and also this karmic relationship with this kid that i was just talking about she's only in it for the money not even wanting to take care of you or help you look at this karmic lady doesn't even give a shit about the kid you know what time it is look what he's holding on to the dad's watch the kids love their dad they love their father but this lady's trying to stay in between and that's not how it's supposed to go okay so whoever this is for listen baby you let that karmic cycle go, you're going to get some money. I promise you. One plus three is four. Domesticate family life. Once you let it go, you're going to get some money. I'm not saying ruin it, but I'm saying if it no longer serves you, what are you still doing? That's what I want to know, okay? The mature woman, that's where you really want to be, okay? So listen, the mature person is going to bring you great fortune. And maybe listening to me today is going to bring you great fortune. Two, 26, eight, abundance, six, eh, told you, okay? The mature woman okay guys so there you go for that okay um ooh. so spirit tell me how do you openly extend your love for someone okay for religious factors so some so maybe you guys both think think about things listen twin flame soulmates one person's always awakened more than the other person is it's always like that it's just like they got to catch up okay so if you're more spiritually inclined than your other person just relax maybe just help them out a little bit okay and flirt extend your lightheartedness and your open love to others okay guys remember today we're supposed to be loving ourselves a little bit more than we always do and yes this is a soulmate relationship so whatever you're not letting go oh i can't make this shit up look at spirit says let go of control issues allow this situation to unfold naturally yeah everyone wants to know but guess what guys if we had the answers to everything how would we grow we wouldn't but it's important that you talk so the most important thing about twin flames and soulmates and everything like that is that you guys talk and have conversations. That That's the only way. Like, listen, we were born, I was just saying this yesterday, we were born naked, right? We were born naked with us, our parents, whoever was in the room, right? There was no conditions to how your parents love you, okay? There was no conditions, hey, there was no conditions to the way your parents loved you, right? You just got older and then, you know, the conditions got put on you. But at the end of the day, ooh, my potato chip bag moved. Um, at the end, yeah, that was weird. At the end of the day, hi, good morning, Grand Rising Queen. Um, after this, I'm going over to my other side. So stay tuned, stay close. We're doing pick a card readings. So um, yeah, what I was saying was that you guys were born into this life with no conditions, okay? So who are you to say that someone needs conditions to be with them, to have money and everything? And no, 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 it doesn't work like that, okay? We love each other because we want. This relationship is also causing for reconciliation. So if you've been thinking about someone, go. Put the thought action to it. What are we waiting for? There's no time like today because tomorrow's not promised. Neither is the next 10 minutes. Like freak shit happens all the time. So don't hold back. I used to hold back, guys. So look at 
whatever i'm acclimated you guys gotta come to my youtube channel one day so one day yeah because they're not on my youtube channel for my youtube subscribers my um my my instagram they're not acclimated to my youtube channel so i used to talk to this guy whatever long time he passed away hardcore thug life we outside all the time i never like really expressed my feelings and shit until after he passed away and i said fuck this then i probably became over emotional because i couldn't control it because i was so afraid not to tell someone i cared about them and maybe I became over emotional and it's just me to you like to share. I have nothing to hide because I need you guys to trust me, okay? Well, I don't need you. You trust me or you don't. Fuck it. I know what I'm doing. So anyways, um, listen, so you deserve love, okay? No matter what you do in this world, you lead with love. You deserve love no matter what, okay? This, we were born with love with no conditions, so there's no conditions. I love you naked with what just you have, no money or nothing. Of course, we need to survive, but it's not about that okay and like i said before release your ex and my reading i just used my kipper boo a long time ago like a couple minutes ago so it was the reading was there a divine masculine feminine situation and the energies resonate that they need to let it go yes it was kids involved but they need to let it go retreat take care of yourself okay you come first see this this is what you want but you can't do this if you're always in despair over an ex your children will be fine. You'll be okay, all right? If you don't pay attention to red flags, you're never going to get what you want. So look what I, look at. Wedding codependency, red flags. I can't make this shit up, okay? Express your love, deception. So spirits here tell me, like, let it go. If you don't let it go, you're going to fuck your life up. Literally, I said to my twin flame, you're ruining us. You're ruining us. You're ruined, you ruined us, okay? Twin flame relationships. So when you guys get to know each other, get to know each other a little bit better, okay? The chemistry is there. Listen, when you're separated from your divine masculine, ooh, we have to talk about the separation phase. So listen, I've been outside 100,000 years, okay? I dealt with guys that come, go, come, go, come, go. But it didn't bother me because I'm outside too. Leave me alone. We're fine. We're straight. We see each other. We see each other. So in that separation, I also dealt with guys that went to jail for months. So I could hold my shit down and not fuck around. You know, someone needs someone to talk to. But at the, at the end of the day, um, yeah, separation is okay. Separation is for you, for growth, for yourself, okay? It's not for to say oh and don't wait by the phone saying when are they gonna call or text no when you feel intuitively guided to that's okay when you feel intuitively guided to reach out reach out that's what you gotta do you gotta go by the way you feel i don't care if i'm wrong i say i'm wrong i don't want to fight no more that's it okay all right you guys gotta express your feelings okay yes yeah you have to just go with where good intuition and how you feel okay and this relationship could be affected by finances and career but the overall energy that i get from this reading from this morning is somebody wants to be in a good relationship don't wait when you feel into intuitively guided to reach out then you should okay all right and you guys hear the song i just i just put the music on for you guys okay so we could try to find out what happened in this relationship if you guys want I'm so happy that you stayed with me. OMG. I was gonna drink my breakfast thing, but I'm not. So let's see, let's let's start a beginning and see what happened to the beginning of this relationship. Yeah, somebody was really flighty. Coming in unsure, not knowing what they want to do. Okay. Look at the horses, like, man, I told you I'm sick of this. The seventh bitch this week, you still doing that King of Swords, not not caring. I mean, Knight of Swords. Then I said King of Swords, listen, got stuck in this karmic ass energy. Okay, there's the divine masculine that doesn't want to be in this energy anymore. I could tell right now from reading. Yeah, he said, I made, I want love. I don't want love. I want love. I don't want a, a thousand hundred bitches. Okay, I don't want that anymore. And you got your justice, divine masculine. Okay, your justice is spirit's going to bless you with the woman that's supposed to be in your life. Be with you. Okay, even if you have a little bit to offer, don't worry about it. It's still, she's still going to be your queen. Okay no worries hi if you're just joining from my youtube hey guys you're always gonna have the queen of pentacles you know why because you were divinely guided to be with her okay and yes i think you should make that move to the lady that you want to be with why not tell me why not okay um hold on you could be in my video in a second okay i just want to finish this and then at the end i'll pull you guys to come in if you want to talk or have any questions fine no worries just stay with me okay so this divine masculine wants to come forward or this divine feminine go do it okay six of cups you have something to offer 
okay you have something to offer healing just all as long as you're healing yourself you're okay all right guys so expect communication i'm um, look at this all these people and not no one's fulfilled them but they know where they want to go who bought out the love who bought out the who bought out the comfort in them okay guys because that was the whole world okay yes stubborn yep that's gonna yeah that is definitely stubborn energy six of cups okay so this relationship that you guys are thinking about or want to think about and if you're not on the live that's okay you're gonna see this anyway okay go divine feminine divine masculine no one's worried about how much money you have remember unconditioned there's no conditions to love at all that's what spirit wants me to tell you stay optimistic about your love life there's no conditions okay and you are the queen of cups you are who he wants. Yeah, he was juggling everything, but the universe is giving him so many divided guidance, synchronicity signs. You can't make them up. I can't make you guys find synchronicities. If you see the numbers, you see things, you see their name, you smell their scent, or someone says something that looks like them, that's because that's who you're supposed to be with. That's who you're supposed to be with, okay? And to it once, it, this is a soulmate relationship that this divine feminine or masculine is manifesting. So d just listen, actions prove by words mean nothing. Okay? Absolutely manifesting a twin flame relationship. 11, 11, 11, 11, 22, 44. Okay? Those are numbers that you guys receive when you're in love. Twin flame circumstances. No one love. Yeah, we're in love. We're older now. Okay, guys? Because they're manifesting. They're manifesting relationship. They're manifesting the money with this relationship. They're manifesting good sex with this relationship. They're manifesting good emotions with this relationship. See this abundance? They're saying being with my divine feminine or masculine gonna bring me abundance. You guys follow the synchronicities. Before you know it, you're gonna be learning about shit. You're like, how the hell did I start learning about this stuff? Stay grounded. Okay, take your own stuff, use it as a blueprint. Okay, that's how you do it. That's how you learn. Oh my God, I I looked up so... All I do is read and, and watch videos and shit. I tell you, um, I don't watch TV that much because... Okay, guess what? Prove me wrong. Go in front of the TV, turn it on, sit there, okay? Start thinking about shit, think about something, I don't know, way off. You could be watching the basketball game. The commentators are going to start talking about what's in your brain. I'm here to tell you I'm divinely guided. I am the chosen one, I promise you. I promise you, okay? Trust me, it happens all the time. That's why I don't watch TV. I listen to music. I only watch TV when I want to receive a message. Like this crazy bitch, no, I'm intuitive. I'm a genius. I'm psychic as fuck. Trust me when I tell you. Look at page of wands. And this relationship is like, has like a lot, is, is really like amazing with sex, okay? So not only does this person want to be in a relationship with you, but their sex is off the bomb. It's, it's off the bomb. It's off the hook. It's off the chain, okay? This is a true love relationship. So look, you guys also can tell a twin flame by when they touch you. When you guys touch each other, you're like, whew, that's like a magnetic force, okay? That's why I say don't touch me because it's, eh, when you touch me, it's a whole nother problem, okay? And sometimes when guys are overwhelmed or women as well, they get into this energy, they're so defensive, they're like, oh, fuck no, this person bought out feelings in me, now I'm on the defense, now I just want to fuck bitches 100,000 miles an hour, I can't even concentrate. Like, listen, if you think your divine masculine is not watching your divine feminine, they are, I got blocked, so I can't, and I lost all my pictures, so I can't, so yeah. And sometimes these relationships will leave you in this energy. And this is also surveillance watching. So, yeah, he's there. He's closer than you know it. Trust me. Trust me. Listen, you guys ask spirit to, to guide you in this, okay? Nanus words is like kind of like staying up at night worrying about it. Yeah, we all did that. Been there, done that, okay? But that doesn't change anything. Get your beauty sleep, divine feminines and masculines, okay? Look at because they're coming in with an offer. A very, very small offer. Very defensive, too. So if they're defensive, you... You just kind of got to listen, roll with the punches. Everyone's love language is different, so I can't make this shit up. Page of Swords followed by the Ace of Swords. They want a new beginning. They're saying, I'm so sorry. We always forgive. We always forgive our divine masculines, okay? And they're told you they're coming in with a little bitty offer. He thinks about you too just as much, trust me. They're like, I don't have anything to offer. That's okay. Love, no conditions, okay? And sex. This person really wants sex because they're tired of fighting with other people for sex. They have all these other people in their life and they don't even want it. They secretly, secretly are wanting their divine feminine. Because look, who wants to put up a fight for sex all the time? Look, you got four or five bitches. Three of them don't even satisfy you. Two of them, you're like, these bitches are dubs as fuck. Right? 
But you're like, I'm tired of fighting them. You're tired of fighting. You don't want to be in that energy. Who wants to fight for sex all the time? That's half the battle, okay? So get rid of the secrets. There are no secrets. But what Spirit is saying, if you want the new beginning, you got to get rid of the old bitches, the ones that aren't helping you, the people that aren't in your life. You're not supposed to be around them. That's okay. That's what they're for. They're karmics, okay? Just hang out. Just hang out a little bit longer, okay? Divine Feminine Masculines are having the strength to come forward. They're learning. You have to give them a chance, okay? They're learning. Ooh, I don't do reversals yet, guys. This is my go shopping card, but I always say go shopping card because I feel like women shop emotionally. Don't do that, Divine Feminines. Um, yes, definitely with the truth. So don't emotionally shop. So I used to emotionally shop all the time and before I keep going. And um, no, we're saving our money now. So February, we're saving our money. No more shopping, no more out to eat, no more nothing. Unless you want to go out to eat, that's different. I love the experience. But more so, like we're, we're supposed to be saving our money. This is strictly for my divine feminines. There's a plan for you at the end of this month. Stay close, stay, 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 stay clear. Stay close. What did Donald Trump say? Stay firm. <sighs> Here I go drooling again. Stay something. If someone could tell me what Donald Trump said, I can't, I can't remember. I have to look it up after. So yeah, so give this to my medicine i'm thinking this is like a leo energy guys i'm learning how to read the cards leo lioness yeah this lady's super abundant look at he's saying i'm having the strength to come close to you okay i'm having the strength to come close to you because i know being with my divine feminine look at over her head guys it's abundance okay that's where it all goes because you learned okay you learned you said if i take what i have I'm learning from the universe. Look at the sun. I take what I have. I pour it into myself. That's what you got to learn. Remember I said love thyself, guys, okay? It's all about yourself, okay? All about yourself. Because you don't, your victory is going to come from walking away from things that no longer suit you. Look at things that no longer suit you. All these people in your life, they're not doing nothing. Look at a little bitty petal at the bottom. Oh, see, girl, that's, that's for you especially. Yes, this is for you. See, spirit guide, guide, guided you here. Yes, okay? So look at you're bound to suck in this energy if you don't change your life, okay? Six of wands, that's victory. Go where your heart desires. See this horse proudly stepping out. Proudly stepping to go find what they want. Yes, intuitive, not crazy. I got We got to change the way we talk. Spirit never knows the difference between, okay? Six of Wands is victory. Go for it where your heart desires. That's how you really win. Because you got all these options you don't even want. I forgot what I was going to say. Because look it, you want a new beginning because you're over it. So just make the transition go, okay? Make the transition go, okay? Ace of Cups, guys. To the four of cups, okay? Over, this is over it. You want the new beginning, you're over it, okay? You want to come in with an offer. And listen, you guys are, stop worrying about money because Spirit said at the end of the day, when you when you go into this relationship, we're going to make sure you have everything you need. Seven of pentacles is watching your fruits of your labor, okay? Ten of pentacles is having the family life, the relationship, everything you want to don't fuck with me. See, look at this. We ended with this. I can't make this shit up, okay, guys? Did you ever make love to a thug in Terminal 110? I didn't say that. Hey. True love, okay? Like I said before, true love. It's worth waiting for. Sometimes you have to wait. Waiting is better, okay? Waiting is so much, so much better. You guys, I used to love Terminal 110, 110 okay? Uh, that's in New Haven, Connecticut for anyone watching. Okay, so this relationship is calling for attraction. And this could be the one, okay? So just give it a chance, guys. Just give it a chance, okay? And yes, like I said before, this relationship is affected by children. But listen, sometimes we come together just to have children with people. Not like, like I said, you cannot get a family from a fuck. You know, you just can't. Okay. So spirits come for this situation to heal yourself. Love yourself. Oh my God. Learn to love. Oh my God. I can't make this shit up. Learn to love someone. Learn to love yourself, but most importantly, learn each other's love language because the person that you had kids with is not who you're supposed to be with. It's unrequited. All that fighting and shit, no, it's not worth it. Free yourself, okay? You could still be parents of those kids if you don't live in the same household. I tried it. I tried it, okay? Be playful about it and let your friends help. There's real passion, okay? Real passion involved. Let your friends help. Sometimes people on the outside know more than people on the inside. It's called outside looking in. That's how you that's how you know it. You know, you gotta allow your to trust, okay? Trust the universe and trust this. Okay? 
trust it hey you have to learn to trust the universe okay so very soon you're going to be coming to a relationship because spirit's saying you're calling in your past life you're calling in your soulmate this is where you're supposed to be i'm so glad i got no karmic energy here yeah look at nine of pentacles another energy another fruits of the labor i can't make this shit up okay guys so the last three cards i got for this divine feminine divine masculine love reading is it's safe for you to love okay make an effort go away do what you got to do okay do what you got to do to nurture yourself and also to nurture this connection always wait patiently baby always always okay so i'm just gonna end this reading guys with with um oh let me see my love cards my whispers of love that i look how fresh these are i never use these i have so many cards i just when spirit says go get a new card i go that's what i do okay so choose love you always have choice make yours with love i told you guys we lead with love always okay and receive with love and appreciation graciously accept is a gracious gracious acceptance is a way to show love so love language everyone's love language is different okay love language is so different from person to person just because one person likes something doesn't mean the other person's gonna like it okay guys we have to learn that so when you get to learn the learn your new lover and how they are you have to learn their love language okay it's not just because some okay so like for instance i do sometimes and sometimes do or don't care about good morning text messages but when i need it i need it when i don't i don't okay and i can't make this shit up spiritual connection i'm telling you guys these relationships are divinely guided by the universe i'm gonna leave off of that a relationship has a connection that goes beyond this lifetime yeah so whatever you guys don't fix in this lifetime you're gonna have to repeat next lifetime okay yeah that's it i'm not even you are limitless because thanks for being here guys being divinely guided okay look at free yourself we just got that card too it's all about freedom listen here i'm gonna oh my god i can't keep going i got look to your inner strength for that's for my leos out here that's for my leo boo right here this for you baby you got everything you need look inside yourself okay everything you need look at i said look inside yourself anything that you need is right there for you okay but i want to go back to this one you are limitless anything you can do anything you choose anything you put your mind to is for you okay anything see the unicorn fring you see the two swans that's soulmate connection soulmate you can't do that you're welcome sweetheart i'm so glad you're here queens help queens that's what we do that's what i'm here for okay you guys this is a soulmate connection so keep your faith okay move how spirit tells you to move it's no um it's no ego involved with love okay if you say i call them if you want to call you, well don't get psycho and call a thousand times but if you want to talk to someone call them if you're thinking about them call them they don't cross your mind for no reason okay and my nose is about to run so that's like that's the god honest truth so thanks for being here guys well, two more, two more things, two more things. Cause I gotta, I gotta, I gotta let you guys go with love. Look at, I feel sensual. Like I said, whatever you feel, do it. Sensual, sexy ass goddess energy. Stay sexy goddesses. Wear his favorite lingerie, wear his favorite colors. Do whatever you gotta do. Send him pictures. He better not show no one. Send him videos. Do what you gotta do. Keep it going. You might not be able to see each other all the time, but you could still love them from far away. Send them love, even in separation. You think they can't feel that shit? They felt that pussy. They know what time it is all right take care of little things so maybe you guys need to take care of things in your life and you will be able to fix yourself okay the river of god has plenty of water god is water for you it provides a bountiful harvest of grain for you for you have order itself okay psalm 65 9 so listen your divine feminines will water the fuck out of you as long as you take care of her too it's a two-way street Ooh, i'm cussing and everything focus on god's love so listen these divinely connections are divinely guided okay i just want to do some sexy tarot cards because now i'm getting in my shit and i started talking about water and goddess water and all this other stuff hey dreamy all right look at because you are the one you are the one okay you are the one this relationship is calling you to put your guards down with everything look at these two people are surrendering they're look at first of all it's a blazing ass sexual ass connection okay they're they're filling each other's cups up they're not they're not being so they're not here to stab each other in the back and pentacles it's all about love what is this little thing oh and this is like a boat so this relationship will take them very very far okay very very far look at sexual they're sex and standing up yeah you do it when you want your divine masculine and divine feminine you will do anything to get to them and not stepping on other people is like real shit. It's seven o'clock on the dot. 
You hear this song right here, guys? Exactly. So, yeah, wait for your divine masculine. Ooh, look at another 11, okay? Is this 11 or the Empress card? Hold on. Because I don't know Roman numerals, guys. I can't even figure it out. I don't know why I'm having a heart. I can remember so much shit, but not Roman numerals. Oh, yeah, this is the priestess, okay? This card is signified for virginity. So I know I didn't fuck since last year. You guys know I keep it raw. I, I have to stay pure until I see my divine masculine, okay? You, I have to close that cycle up before I can be with anyone else. So it is what it is. Okay, guys? So stay pure. That's what you got to do. Wait for your divine masculine. He's taking a chance too. Remember, hello. It's not all about just the females and what how they are. It's about divine masculine. He has to be comfortable and take a chance too. So give him a chance to change, to open up. Okay? To open up. I'm getting sidetracked because I got a message right here that he's coming as an emperor energy. Okay, king, queen of wands, king of pentacles. This relationship is full of abundance. Look at the horse is high stepping right with them. Yes, we're going to go get this money, baby. Okay, oh my God, I got another wands. Okay, yes, stay loyal. That's what you got to do. Wands is about sex too. So I keep telling you guys, this divine masculine not only wants, wants you for comfort, but he wants you, he wants, he likes your sex too. Look at you fill his cups up, five of cups. You fill his cups up, no one else. He had five of cups and other things, other options, but no, for you, divine feminine and divine masculine, you are. Look at, he's coming back in the king of pentacles energy saying, yes, this is what I really want. Now they're on a the fucking, now they're on a the damn elephant. That's how strong and boldly that this person wants to come back into your life and allow them, okay? Go with intuition, use your discernment. These relationships are hard as hell okay yeah when he's ready he will talk okay because he's gonna take a real chance all right because he's ending karmic cycles with other people and other women look at he said when i come to my divine feminine i don't have to have my guards up but i want to guard my relationship again twin flame relationship he's fucking this bitch with the sword and i don't mean it like that i just talk like that because that's outside language and god said i can't still talk like that okay guys look at see guarding this relationship with his whole entire heart okay with his swords he doesn't want anyone else involved or in this relationship so maybe he doesn't want to have threesomes whatever who knows guys right who knows all right one more I, i'm supposed to be going i say one more i do this all the time because spirits is divinely guiding me oh hold on one second one second guys okay all right, look it. It says bear. Okay, so love each other. I don't bear. So he, in hibernation, obviously. And he's coming out. And he said this karmic is disgusting. So don't worry about the karmic. He's hiding from her too. He doesn't want her. He thinks she's nasty and she stinks too. Oh, look it. He doesn't want to be sneaky anymore. He doesn't want to be sneaky anymore. He wants an engagement. And he just has hurdles to climb, okay, guys? So let's give our Divine Masculine a chance, okay? And like I said, again, he's still worried about his kids, all right? If there's kids, in fact, in the play, Divine Feminine, Divine Masculine, make it right and easy for the other person, okay? All right, guys, I'm out of here. So you guys come over to my um, YouTube channel. I'm going to have a pick a card love reading. I just got to clean this mess up. Thank you so much to my Instagram fam. I'm helping us, guys. I'm here. Reach out to me, all right? I'm still doing free readings. I just got to schedule a time that's good for you, good for me. Don't be scared. There's nothing to be scared of. Divinely guided, meaning divine. God, me. All we need is me, you, and God, okay? Um, I have one of my YouTube followers here. I don't know if you, when you guys watch, you get to see the... Uh, the um messages that we're talking back and forth but she i'm 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 here yeah i'm i'm not uploading this on youtube i'm gonna upload um well i could right i could no i can't do live on youtube yet i'm not i don't have enough followers or anything yet but um yeah i can't do it yet but yeah i'm gonna go on youtube right now yep give me about 10 minutes to fix everything youtube won't let me do live like this but i can just do a video and upload it so i'm gonna do pick a card so stay tuned girl i'll be over there in one second so thank you guys for being here and i'm um, watching my videos i know most of you guys are gonna watch it on my feed and that's okay all right i'm i'm dropping dimes for you guys i want us all to be prosperous i got big dreams for us guys you're like girl bye but i do i always envision our community like in the 70s nice nice black community where all our kids are having fun everyone's outside no one's worried we're loving each other like can we do that again i hear so many stories from older people that how our community used to be way much better than it than it is now okay and i think that we can get back to that it just takes one one of us okay 
international grocery stores. I think we need something for the kids. I see in Westville they put up um, a community center. That's good. Where are my bakers and cake makers? Get together. Open up a bakery. A black bakery. Not black bakery. I shouldn't say it like that. I'm sorry. But open up a bakery. We have all these people. We got the, we got the fitness down pack, guys. We got the clubs down pack. You know what I'm saying? There's some people that take good pictures. Great engineering. Great photography. What are we doing? Stop wasting talent. We have a whole community full of talented people. People that make amazing clothes and designs. Creative store. Open up a store where you people come in and they make their stuff, their designs. I don't know. Spirit's telling me that we have so much creativity in this New Haven town that it's being put to waste for no reason. We are the ones. We are the ox, guys. Okay? We are the strength. It's us or nothing else. Okay? Eat or be eat. And so we're going to eat. Listen, if New Haven wasn't supposed to be on the map, why can we see it from Florida? Driving from Florida, I saw New Haven, Virginia, Washington, D.C., Maine. We're here for no reason. If you ever look at documentaries about cartel and everything, New Haven, they're always coming through here. Underground Railroad passed through here. Don't play with me. Pray for me. I'm telling you. Yes. So, guys, do what you got to do. There's a lot of abundance in this city. We have a thousand dead people buried downtown unbeknownst to us all over the city woodbridge used to be a very prosperous city okay guys so there's money to be made all we gotta do is manifest it dig it up and get it back to how it used to be all right divine empress 06 baby over to my youtube channel thanks for being here guys uh sir for watching i guess i can't say like and subscribing but you guys want to put you guys onto my youtube channel soon i just need to know that you'll be grateful and appreciative Mwah. enjoy super bowl sunday